when L.A. blew up. The Bloods and the Crips basically shook hands. Ceasefire. Ceasefire. We're going to steal as much shit as we possibly can. They were making millions off of all the shit they were stealing, all the gun stores they were breaking into. Well, it didn't seem like there was a lot of gang on gang crime. Like, people were fighting over what they were stealing. They were just like, there's enough Nikes in here for everybody. And so they put us on the ground. And then it was basically Marines on every single corner. Kilo Company had a checkpoint. We were there for a couple, for a little bit. A Z28 ran the checkpoint. And then he turned around and came back. Humvees parked, five tons parked. So with like, with like M2s or? With everybody there, you like, know, but standing no around. bullets. I'm sure they all had ammo, but nobody was loaded. And nobody okay. wanted to be the guy to fire. I'm pretty sure this was suicide by cop, maybe. Because like a genius, he broke through, got through the other side, and then he turned around and came back. And then they stitched him up with a saw and killed him. Because of posse comitatus and the fact that it, it's technically illegal to use federal troops against local citizens, in the paper they said the National Guard had killed the guy. 